Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. If you are new, my name is Nastasia and even though Christmas is in a few days, apparently I don't know that and I have yet another little haul for you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's not a ton of stuff, but I still wanted to share it with you guys. But before I get into it, if you end up liking this video, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you never miss out on a video every time I post. Alright, I'm going to start with my, probably my favorite things I got. I got perfume from Altered State. So I smelled this perfume like months ago. Um, the closest Altered State to me here in Virginia is like an hour away. Um, and I have been looking for a perfume because all I've been wearing, which is totally fine, um, is Bath and Body Works. But I, I like having an actual like perfume, like I, I like having a scent. And their body sprays are great, but they don't last very long and for like you might think it's not that expensive but for how much you have to use to get a scent it's kind of expensive um and i just i love warm vanilla sugar that's my go-to scent from bath and body works if you are interested at all but um i kind of wanted something different i guess and i've been smelling perfumes literally everywhere <laughs> i tried victoria's secret the other day i've tried a bunch at sephora i tried like I smell them on other people and they smell great and then I'm, I just don't like them then um, when I try them and stuff. And so all I kept remembering was the one from Altered State that I loved and couldn't stop smelling my wrist when I sprayed it on myself. And I was like, oh man, I really want to get it. And I was like, I don't want to ask for it for Christmas. It's already too late. Um, and so I was like, whatever, I'm just going to make the hour drive because I didn't want to order it online just in case I didn't like it for some reason. I wanted to smell it again and get it. And all of that to say, I was so like nervous that I wasn't going to like it again or that it was going to be too expensive and blah, blah, blah. I got there, guys, and it was buy one, get one free for like their perfumes, like their nice like more pricier perfumes. So this was the one I was going to get originally anyway. It is the um, Sanctuary scent. It's freaking gorgeous. Um, and it came in a really pretty box too, but I already took it out of the box. It smells like fresh. Like a tiny, hmm. It reminds me a tiny bit of like the Daisy scent, um, but it's not so flowery. There's a little bit of like, I don't know, like sultriness to it, I guess. like. It's like a tiny bit woodsy. <laughs> I don't know. Like a little bit vanilla-y and flowery. And like it's a very like daytimey perfume, if that makes sense. It probably doesn't at all. Um, but this one is Sanctuary. It's freaking gorgeous. I think it's so nice. And it was buy one, get one. So I was like, I could get two of the same or I could get another smell. So I was smelling them. And this one is also freaking gorgeous. Can we just? And this one's called Love Scroll. And I love them both, <laughs> but this is more of like a nighttime perfume. This is more of like a cozy, like it smells a little bit similar to this, but it's more like, it reminds me a little bit more of like the Britney Spears, um, what is that, fantasy? A little bit more towards that, and this is more like the daisy scent from whatever that brand is. <laughs> um, yeah, this is a little bit more like a little bit even more woodsy, a little bit more like, um, like musky, and mm, it smells so good, and honestly guys, these smell really good layered on each other, so I'll usually do a spritz of this and a spritz of this, and I'm freaking obsessed, and they're buy one get one, I don't know if they're still doing that or not, but I was like, yes. <laughs> accessory I got, it's like the only accessory I have to show you. Um, but it includes these hoops, but it came in a pack of three, so there are these rose gold hoops I got from H&M for like $7 for all three of these. I really want to be a hoop girl, and I figure I'm moving to a new city, I can be whatever kind of girl I want to be. So I'm trying to be a hoop girl. So I've been, I've had these in all day trying to get, I never wear earrings, so I'm trying to get my ears used to like wearing earrings again, so that they're not so like irritated by it. Um, these are a little big for me. I don't know if I'll ever be able to wear these, but these are cute. I feel like I could wear these on like a daily basis and these for like, I don't know when I actually want them to like really show. So I got those. I got this one like a while back and I've worn it quite a few times, but this is from Five Below. I know I wore it in one of my other videos, but I still wanted to show it to you. It's just like a pink knit beanie with like a fuzzy like ball on the top. 
It's from Five Below. I think it was like four or five dollars, and it's bomb. So if they still have those, get them. Okay, so starting with clothes, I got from Forever 21, not a lot of stuff, but just a lot, like some of the stuff I got is like comfort or like more like fitness kind of wear. Um, I got three camis, which I'm not going to show you. I already packed them to go home for Christmas and they're, you know what a cami looks like. I got those just because those are really nice for me to like work out in. I just put over like my sports bra and leggings or something. I got these mauve leggings. So Forever 21 is known for their like cheap leggings, but they've kind of stepped up their game a little bit. So these were like the, um, like the $4 or whatever ones. Um, I accidentally put a hole in it already, like a tiny little hole. That was my bad. I was trying to pull at the tag and it like snagged it, but I don't really care. They were only $4 <laughs> and they have like this longer waistband now. Usually it used to be like really, really, really thin, tiny waistband, which was fine also for like $4, but these are like nice and they are this nice mauve kind of, um, purpley pink color really really soft so comfortable I got mine in a size small um and I really like them they're high-waisted um so I love these and I also got them in black which are also really really nice like it, this one I think these are the four dollar ones I think the mauve ones were like six dollars and these are like the four dollar ones but still the waistband is like at least like two inches which is nice and then um they're just black leggings but they're also like high-waisted and I wear black leggings to work every day anyway um and so I wear I go through a lot of black leggings and my black ones I had had like three holes in them so I was due for a new pair of four dollar leggings um but leggings are a freaking staple for me even with working out like I don't need any fancy anything to work out in speaking of which I got like this little workout outfit from Forever 21 and like guys you don't have to buy super expensive workout stuff like forever 21 stuff is really freaking cute things for pretty inexpensive so i got this sports bra which is really really cute and flattering and it's like um i don't know it, it's kind of like the what is this material called i don't know it's like kind of like stripey um but it's already padded and stuff which is nice um i got mine is a size small it's not like too short on me at least i don't feel like I have a pretty flat chest, so that's not really an issue, um, but I really like this. And then I got some matching leggings to go with it. They didn't come in a set. I paid for them separately, but I just found some that matched. So I got these leggings. Um, both of these items were not very expensive at all. It has a little zipper here. Let's see if it's a real pocket. It is. Oh, wow. That's pretty, it's a pretty deep pocket. Um, so you can put your phone in there or something. That's nice. And I got these also in a size small. Um, and yeah. I really like them a lot, so I'm really happy with these. Okay, and then the other clothing items I have are from, where would I have guessed this, Aeropostale. So I was at the mall getting my perfume by myself an hour away, making a day out of it, and I figured, you know what, I'm here. I might as well just check it because Aeropostale, I feel like, is always like going out of business, <laughs> so they always have like all these sales. I was like, you know, maybe, maybe I'll find, like, some stocking stuffers or something, or, like, um, a cute hat for, like, my sister-in-law or something, um, which I did not, <laughs> but they had a few things that I was like, oh, these are not bad, so, like, they still have some sweatshirts that are, like, annoying and just say, like, arrow, like, all over the place and stuff like that, um, that are kind of gross, but, like, if you look, they had some good deals, so, like, I got this red shirt, from there and this is like their version of you know how American Eagle has their like soft and sexy brand or like little category of like the really really soft shirts like the really soft like long sleeves and stuff there it, this is exactly like it literally exactly like it and I got this on sale for eight dollars so and it wasn't even like a clearance like it was just they had sales going on and they had this also in pink but I already have a lot of pink shirts um and I don't have any this is my only red shirt I literally own <laughs> um and they also had it in like yellow and uh they had some in v-necks like an eggplant color and stuff like that so check them out because they have these and they're so so soft and they were on sale for like $7.98 or something like that when I was there the other day and the other thing I got there which I was super happy I found that if you know that like the waffle fabric trend that's happening right now that I also am obsessed with um so they have those too. So I got this white sweater. It has like the lime, the lime seam kind of thing down the back again. And um, 
they only had this white one in a size large, but I didn't mind because I kind of like that it like slouches off the shoulder and I can roll up the sleeves and wear it with leggings. It's so freaking soft, guys. And um, they have these in a couple different colors too. They had a pink one, but like I already have so many pink shirts um, and I don't really have any just like white long sleeves um, other than just like a big sweater. And so I got this and this was like $9.98, um, which is also amazing. Um, so like they might have these in different colors where you are and it's so soft and I just really like it. These might seem boring to you because they're like basics, but I really like basics. Maybe I'm just basic. <laughs> and then the last um, thing I got from there, which this is super fun to me, that I also got at Airpostel, is this shirt, which never would have expected me to buy something like this, at least not now. Um, and it's so cute. <laughs> it's like this little kind of peplum thing with the little like um, lacing in the front and like it's a long sleeve and it has these little red roses on it. Guys, it's adorable and it's really soft too and it's thin and kind of like that stretchy back so it's comfortable. I got this in a size small as well. This was, um, I don't know if this, I think this was on sale, but I think it was still like $13, um, which still isn't bad, but again, not even in the clearance section, just out on the floor, everything was on sale basically, and it's so cute. They also had this in like, um, I don't know, they had this in like a more of a maroon color with different colored flowers or something, but I liked this one so much. I think it's so cute for like any season, I'm stoked about this top. I don't have anything like this and that excites me because I have a lot of everything. <laughs> okay, I got a new planner for 2019. I'm very excited about it. Um, I love planners. <laughs> I usually have a couple and I probably will again for this year. Um, but this is, the brand is the Happy Planner. That's what my planner for 2017, 18 was too. So I got one for 2019. I got a big one though. I love big planners. I feel like I can just, get everything done on paper. I don't have to like try to like fit it all in. I can just write. Um, and so it's, this is the faith one. Um, not all of them are the faith one, but I got this one specifically because it was, and I thought it was really cute. So every month has like a new picture. Um, and then on this side, it has like scripture to memorize, um, on my heart, gratitude, remember dates, and then answered prayers, which I thought was really good for me. Um, because then I can like, I don't know, keep track of that and hold myself accountable for that. And then it also has a, like, the calendar days, which I've already filled. I usually use my big, like, the calendar par a portion of it with just video ideas for you guys. So there's a little sneak peek into that. I already have all these written down. Um, but then, like, the days... There's like, you know, the days listed out there and it's like horizontal and you can write whatever you want. And then there's a little thank you for, thankful for box in the bottom. Um, there's different like pictures on every single one. The April one is my favorite. Um, not sponsored, I'm just obsessed with this. <laughs> and I got some more books because I have a problem apparently. I only got three, I, got, I only got three, okay. Um, so I'm about to finish Love Does by Bob Goff, um, and I'm going to do a book review on that, so t stay tuned. Got the kind of like, af like the second kind of book following that one by Bob, Bob Goff called Everybody Always. Just all about loving everybody always. <laughs> so I'm really excited about this one. I've heard amazing things. Also the cover is so cute. I love like white with colors on it. I think it's, I don't know, I really like it. It's like, it's, um... Paperback, I got this one from Lifeway, so it still was like, still kind of like pricey, but I like being able to give it to Lifeway instead of like another like bookstore. I got Chase the Lion by Mark Batterson. I feel like I've maybe heard of this, but I literally just picked this up there because I thought it sounded good um, and I had a good feeling about it for some reason. Um, and it's, I think it's all about like running after your God given like talents and goals and stuff. This is a hardback one. They didn't have a paperback one or else I would have gotten the paperback one. It invites ch uh, people to chase dreams so impossible that victory demands we face our fears, defy the odds, and hold tight to God. These are the kinds of dreams that will make you a bigger person and the world a better place. So, yeah, I'm excited about that one. I love things talking about like the dreams and goals God has and the passions God has like put on your heart. So all about that. 
And then I got this one too. I haven't heard about this one at all, but I freaking love Matt Chandler. Guys, if you ever need sermons to listen to, I know some of um, my subscribers have reached out to me before asking for like different sermons. I always, always recommend The Village Church. I love their sermons. Um, I have never listened to one that I disagree with biblically. I feel like they are always spot on. And I'm pretty picky about my sermons too, so like, I really love them. So you can just look up The Village Church on YouTube and they're great. But Matt Chandler is the lead pastor there. And so um, he's freaking brilliant. And this one is called The Explicit Gospel. Um, I basically bought it because <laughs> he wrote it. But it says, even if you go to church, it doesn't mean that you're being exposed to the gospel explicitly. It's really just about how the heart, at the heart of everything is the gospel. So like all the bells and whistles and everything, they're fine, but they are not the gospel. And the gospel is what matters. Um, I don't know, but I'm really excited to try it because I love Matt Chandler. So maybe this will be one of my new faves. We shall see. But that's all I got for you guys. Um, I'm sure I will do like a what I got for Christmas as well. If you guys want that, if you don't, that's fine. Just let me know down below. It'll probably be a lot of the same kind of stuff of like clothes and like bath and body work things or something of the sort and books. I asked for vitamins for Christmas, so maybe that. <laughs> um, but yeah, so feel free. If you don't want to see that, let me know. If you do want to see that, let me know. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. I love you. Bye.